folks, I'm Josh from Lazy Acres. Thank you for tuning in. We are saving the world here, one trailer at a time. Today, we're gonna have a look at a 2022 Keystone Springdale, model number 295BH. We got bunks in the back, front queen, side slide, outside kitchen, a whole whack of storage, Brand new interior for this year. Ever since August 15th, they've got this brand new interior. We've got the new SolarFlex 200, which is a 200 watt panel, 15 amp charge controller. We got ourselves a laundry hamper, all right? But guess what, I'm here with my friend, Brendan Hannemeyer on the camera today. How's it going everyone? Thank you so much for watching. We all really appreciate it. Please like and subscribe. Helps us know you like it. You'll like this new interior. It's really, really cool. I don't know about you, Brendan, but a laundry chute, Launder hamper, that seems like something for the rich. Yeah. When I was young, when I was a kid, we didn't have none of those baskets. We had a pile of dirty clothes on the floor. Sometimes you push it up against the corner of the broom, act as if it was like a pillow, we'd sleep there. It was fantastic. <laughs> but this one's got a laundry shoe, which is which is cool. Front power jack, 20 bumper paint tanks, and then your batteries and boxes are gonna go right, right behind here. Lazy Acres includes one battery, a 24 series, that will fit there nicely for you. Our pass-through storage in through here, Notice up until the left there, we have ourselves our 15 amp charge controller, fresh water fill, city water connection. As we come down the off door side, we have our rack and pinion style slide, pulling our couch, pulling our dine out the floor. The rack and pinion system is, is, is the heaviest system for a slide out, but it is the most reliable. This particular travel is 7,100 pounds. Outside shower, black water flush kit, 50 amp detachable style cord, and then your sewer drain is down below that. I mentioned the front power jack. We also have four power stay butter jacks, full size spare tire. We're gonna put a beautiful Lazy Acre tire cover on there. And then coming around this side, we have uh, a look at our outside kitchen. Two burner stove top that hooks up underneath there to our gas quick neck, two cubic foot electric fridge, and an outside spray port right here, just ready to go for a cold water outlet, spraying things down. And then uh, I forgot about the backup camera prep at the back there. Our awning is great. Great on it, wouldn't you say, Brennan? Very long. Yeah, it covers the outside kitchen, which is key. Starts here. We got LED lights in it. And it ends all the way forward here, giving us great awning coverage. We got the lipper component stairs right down the ground. Lend the hand grab handle, outside TV location, six gallon water heater, and then our furnace is right here. Kitchen window, range hood, outside speakers. Those lights look fantastic. 15 inch tires down there, six bolt hubs, nitro fill. Let's have a look inside. Right off folks, we're inside that Springdale 295BH. Um, just span around, have a look at this new interior. Big fan of the gold handles, the, the black cabinetry, but everything else is so light. Like we got the nice stainless steel uh, fridge, nice light floors, nice light accents, light wall border. It feels very bright in here, even with that black cabinetry, which looks, just looks hot. It looks super modern, looks fantastic. I'm sitting the dinette. This can go down to a bed there for you, easy peasy. Nice secondary sleeping spot. We are gonna have storage underneath both sides of the dinette. And then we've got windows around in the slide here. USBs right there. You can charge your phone, put in that little uh, netting through there. Jackknife style sofa. Storage underneath that jackknife. The jackknife's gonna turn it again to some more uh, secondary sleeping. Let's head into the wash, or sorry, the bedroom here. We've got uh, wardrobe space on both sides of the bed. Both sides of the bed have receptacles. All right, hanging over here, double shelf going on, a nice light underneath there too. And then here's that laundry chute I was telling you about. That's just for the rich. That's awesome, right in through there. And then our walk-in closet. You know what we call a walk-in, right, Brandon? Why? Because you can walk in it, buddy. There's <laughs> lots of space in here. You can hang things up, store things on the bottom. That's a pretty wicked closet. Wicked like, closet. I like the doors they're using. Yeah. How they have the cool, yeah, the same door for both sides. Oh, I see what you mean. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, nice. like the double pocket doors. That, yeah. that is nice. Fantastic. Right on. Um, <clears throat> coming out of the bedroom here, we've got the entertainment center right here across from our couch, which makes sense. We can hook things up and through here, put a TV there easy peasy. Nice fireplace built in down below, which is fantastic. That's putting out some nice electric heat. Our speakers and our radio in there. So we got the one closet around that side. We've also got another closet as you walk in. It's a walk-in closet, Brendan. <laughs> All right. I now so know why. <laughs> okay, there you go. <laughs> Hang things up, store your shoes in through here. That's a, you know, just a, a ridiculous amount of storage for a single slide travel trailer, 7,100 pounds. Now, our kitchen here is killer too. We've got a whole whack of storage. I love the finish, like I said. Um, nice solid handles through here. 
Plates and cups are going to go right there. Microwave, range hood, kitchen window, spot you hang up your utensils. You can also magnetize your knives and stuff like that in through there. I don't suggest going down the road with your knives magnetized there, but you get what I'm saying. Uh, we got ourselves a 10 cubic foot, 12 volt fridge, which works fantastic with the solar panel that we got on here. So we got the solar panel taking juice from the sun. That's that free energy, all right? Bring it down, charging your battery, and then the battery's operating your fridge and all the rest of your 12 volt appliances. Now. This could be your pantry space, okay? It could be some wardrobe space for the kids, whichever, I'll let you guys decide. Whatever it is, there's lots of it. And then we got this bonus storage underneath. And then back into the rest of the kitchen, three burner stove top with a glass stove top cover, oven down below, cupboard space right there for your garbage can. Single cutlery drawer right here. All this is seamless countertops. We got a nice little texture to the, uh, to the uh, countertop here too. Undermount plastic style sink. With the drying rack that covers half of it, boom style faucet, and then we got a little bit more storage back around this side too here, man. Okay, I just I, I I love these new handles, love the new hardware, all that. Now our double over double bunks are here at the back. Each bunk has an individual curtain, which is nice to see. Each bunk has an individual window with an individual light. USBs in the top bunk, USBs in the bottom bunk. I'll let you have a look there, Brennan. Nice bunk room in through there. And then we got a whack of storage underneath there as well, behind our outside kitchen. Into our washroom, top and squat check. Squat check checks out, the dump truck fits. Ring the alarm, over uh, storage right through there. Plastic sink, medicine cabinet, up into the shower. I'm six feet tall, I can shower here easy peasy. The curtain bar feels a little low, you know, but that's okay, I can get used to that, all right. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Please like the video, subscribe to the channel, share that with your friends. Then you can email us here at sales at lazyacres.com. Have yourself a good day.